time for you all to take a little pop quiz. True or false, 90% of aging is due to genetic makeup. Dr. Orton. I know the answer. How about you out there, what do you think? True? You're wrong, it's Make false, in fact. It really is 50-50. Now, I always tell people, take a look at mom and pops and grandpa. That gives you an idea of how you're going to age. It does determine 50% of it. Genes do control things like how much your face is going to fall, sagging, discoloration, lines, that kind of thing. But the other 50% is related to lifestyle. And you know what I'm talking about, smoking, drinking, sun exposure, not protecting your skin from the elements out there, diet, exercise, and how you take care of your skin. All of those play an equal role. So you do and have And control. I think that that is liberating because a lot of people say, ah, oh, you know, Nothing that I do matters. It's all about my genetics. Yeah. It does matter. In fact, they did a study looking at twins. Looking at identical twins is, is the best way to determine mm -hmm. is something yeah. really a valid factor. In this study, they look specifically at smoking, and the twin that smoked visibly aged, I mean, for 10 years of smoking, it adds an extra 2.5 wow. years. Wow. I mean, look at that. That is a, That's huge, a huge difference. difference. And that wow. is the exact same genetic makeup. So I think that's a really important takeaway. Yep. Protect your skin, don't smoke, eat healthy foods, moisturize.